at the end of this video, you should be able to conduct simple research to determine market trends and demands in preserved or processed foods. What is market demand? Market demand describes the demand for a given product and who wants to purchase it. This is determined by how willing consumers are to spend a certain price on a particular good or service. As market demand increases, so does price. When the demand decreases, price will go down as well. Market demand is the total of what everyone with specific industry desires and can help guide merchants when building an e-commerce site. A survey is being done to know who or what the choice of the people is. It is the same way for determining market trends or demands. A survey is conducted to know what the people feel and what they want. Based on the results of the survey, you will know the preference of the market. The product that will produce is based on the choice of that market. Survey is a data collection tool for research and a way of collecting data through asking people, interviews, questionnaires, focus group discussions, and forums. The following needs to be identified when conducting a survey are Participants or respondents Number and characteristics There are three quick tips to improve survey response rates. Here are some ideas to ensure that respondents will answer your surveys. 1. Be quick If your survey is short and sweet, there's a greater chance that more respondents will complete it. 2. Offer incentives Little incentives like small token or an entry into a drawing can help ensure respondents complete your survey. 3. Buy a targeted audience. You can purchase access to an audience who meets a specific demographic criteria for your survey. It's a great way to get targeted responses from a specific group. These are the reminders on how the survey will be conducted. Ensure that the information that is needed will be generated through the questions included in the survey. The plans on the conduct of the survey was polished by the class. How are we going to analyze questionnaire responses? If the group used an online survey, the software will automatically collate the data. Some will just need to download the data, as for an example, a spreadsheet. If the group used a paper questionnaire, someone will need to manually transfer the responses from the questionnaires into a spreadsheet. Put each question number as a column heading and use one row for each person's answers. Then assign each possible answer a number or code. Go through each respondent's questionnaire in turn, adding in the codes. Enter this data into a spreadsheet. Once the group has calculated how many people selected each response, the young researchers can set up tables and or graph to display the data. This could take the form of a table or chart. Remember, surveys being done to know who or what the choice of the people. It is one major research strategies and a popular way of data collection. It is the same way of determining market trends or demands. Based on the results of the survey, you will know the preference of the market. The product that will produce is based on the choice of the market. Market demand describes the demand for a given product and who wants to purchase it. This is determined by how willing consumers are to spend a certain price on a particular good or service.